Hi, my name is Anders and I'm the founder of a Swedish company called Highlander Downtown North. In order to describe what Highlander does, I need to describe the today's general situation for wealth and asset managers. All private individuals, as you and myself, have in one or another way a connection to a pension scheme. Wealth managers, who is representing all us private individuals, does not place the capital into final investment themselves, but instead they're sending the money to different asset managers, who are the ones doing the actual investments. By the way, every time the capital is transferred, there is always a credit risk involved. Will the money come back? The asset manager then places the money in different assets, according to the wealth manager's preferences and rules. This may be in equity shares, or in fixed income bonds, or in real estate. In order to do this, the asset manager needs an infrastructure for the business relations. He needs portfolio managers who analyze and decide what to invest in. And he needs relationships with banks that provide various lines of credits and account services. And he needs access to various stock exchanges and brokers worldwide in order to execute investments. On a regular basis, the asset manager then reports back on how everything goes. The wealth manager and the asset managers most often have different computer systems, causing the issue that the reports are not always in the same form or issued at the same time. When the wealth manager's capital grows by the savers sending in more money, he needs to spread out the risk in different investments. For this reason, they engage more asset managers with different investment areas and different investment styles. As a result, the asset manager receives massively reporting in various formats that today are very difficult to compile. According to the financial authorities, the wealth manager has the ultimate responsibility for all processes being carried out correctly and with full transparency. The wealth manager must ensure that all asset managers make their investment correctly by checking and following their checklists against internal and external rules and regulations. It is easy to realize that the practical situation of the wealth manager quickly becomes unsustainable. When I realized this problem, I sat down and sketched out very sustainable options to solve the situation. I quickly realized that it was a logistic problem that could be solved by modern technology at a reasonable cost. After a wise work on the development of the pillars of the technical solution, a computer system, as a software, I succeeded in convincing a highly experienced, respected English colleague and friend of mine to become co-founded with me in the company developing and offering the product. We decided that this has to be an international solution, and it was not long before we were in touch with a third co-founder, a Frenchman of equal standing and repute. Hey, are you a wealth manager? Come in and I'll show you. Do you see any money that is to be sent? Exactly. You don't need to send money to your asset manager any longer. The money can stay on your bank account. Instead, you can now invite all your asset managers to operate directly from your own bank account. Do you see any frustrated or stressed colleagues or authorities here? They sit there in peace and quiet and drink the coffee. Would you like a cup of coffee? Look at all the reports. They are sorted and ensembled automatically in the correct order with the right content at the right time. Use your time to do the fun stuff, the stuff you should be doing to ensure better returns for your savers. No more call-outs and no more emergency measures. Relax. You can now proudly deliver what the savers are asking for. Yes, good returns. Are you in?